hey guys welcome to the new video today in this video we are going to see some basic operations like reading and writing operations in json in json file using uh, in json string using python that how can you do some like basic operations of reading and writing so let's proceed with our video firstly let's move in our vs code and open your desired folder since I have already selected my desired folder, so I will just pick uh, randomly creating a file name that will be like app.py. And now, since you have to uh, go with JSON data, so firstly you will be needing to import JSON. Since JSON is a JavaScript object notation and it is more similar to like uh, dictionaries in python so firstly we will be creating our json string json string equals and then we will pass some data inside this with some keys and values of normal dictionary first will be just a second, first we need to create a dictionary inside this dictionary and then this will contain a name something like this and now it will load this json data then what you have to do is just simply uh, type data variable equals json dot loads and then just simply load this json string inside this now we have to uh, like we have to print this particular uh, name of this person so now what you will do is you will just simply type print data and then name and let's run this program run python file when you will run this you will see his name okay so this was the reading operation this was the reading operation in json okay so now let's proceed uh, proceed with the writing operation in json for that what you have to do is you uh, you will be needing a dictionary okay the name of the dictionary will be data dictionary and this will contain some data like this so what you have to do is you just have to simply uh, create a json string like this and then you have to type json string equals json dot dump and then dump this data into a file for reading you have to load this data for uh, writing you have to dump this data okay and then just simply type print json string okay just save this and go with this now you can see this the first operation was for reading the data and the second operation was for writing the data so yeah guys that's all for this video now let's see you next time